everyone, welcome back to another vlog. Uh, I'm just hanging out in London today and I just woke up and I really feel like vlogging. Um, so today I am, I'm actually off to go to breakfast, which would be nice. Breakfast meetings are the best. It's not actually a meeting though, it's um, my friend Kelly is hosting this event at Balthazar in Covent Garden. Um, so that'd be really, really nice. I'm gonna head down, see what it's all about, see some friends, get some brekkie. So that'd be really good. And then I'm actually gonna do a bit of shopping today. And I never, ever do this midweek. I'm a little bit jet lagged. I spent all day yesterday kind of catching up on all my work and just like one of those really stressful days. And today, um, I need to do a bit of shopping for some Christmas videos that I have coming up. So um, yeah, I'm gonna head into town and do that. And I think I'm also gonna try and pop in to Glean to pick up some PO Box stuff. So that'll be fun. And um, meet my managers just for a bit of a catch up. And what else have I got going on today? A few other bits, we'll see how the day goes. I don't have a lot planned, but um, yeah. I feel like it's gonna be a good day. Also, look at these leaves outside. The colours are just insane. It's quite grey and gloomy at the moment, so you can't actually see like how bright they are, but, oh, looks amazing. I love this time of year. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here with Venetia. Hello. How stressful has our morning been? The worst. Oh my God, we, uh, for some reason, decided to get the tube. Well, actually, you originally were gonna get the car. Yep. But um, I, I don't know, I convinced you to get the tube, but it was horrendous. We were literally waiting on the platform forever. We had each other though, which actually we was helpful because it, it together. distracted. Yeah, we had a nice chat. The tube was so packed. And it was so quiet though, I feel like everyone was listening to our conversation. Yeah, they were. <laughs> but we made it, we're on our way. I'm hungry now. How cute is Balthazar looking? Oh, you're feeling Christmassy. Yeah, you must do. How great does this table look? I love it. This is like a little private room up here. It looks stunning. And I love promoting and working with young British designers um, who are so passionate about what they do and um, being able to create beautiful things that help my country and the wildlife back at home. This is another 100% um, proceed profit to um, an amazing, transparent organisation. Local Ocean um, is Ranamutamu which is the village that I'm from in Kenya. So these are the amazing pouches by Elizabeth Scarlett. The design is stunning. And 100% of the profits go to charity. And the charity is, if you can see here, the Local Ocean Trust. Is that focusing? There we go, the Local Ocean Trust. To help save these gorgeous little turtles. So I've got a breakfast salad here. We've got avocado, spinach, pumpkin seeds. Looks incredible. Incredible. Oh, and a green tea. Yummy. Love Covent Garden so much, especially at Christmas. I'm um, now on my way to try and find a boots somewhere around here because I need to buy a new toothbrush. How pretty is it around here? I love these decorations. Right, I think boots is down here somewhere. So I'm just trying to find uh, the Oral-B toothbrushes. I've actually had um, one of the Oral-B electric toothbrushes for so long, but it is time to replace it. So I found them. Here they are. I'm looking for the Genius 9000. It's so nice. It's in the special edition orchid purple. I'm 100% getting this. And guys, better than half price. Yes. Loving this reindeer. I want to take him home. <laughs> this is such a tease. I want to know what's going on. <laughs> Just been into this store called The Ordinary and um, I've heard so much about it. Basically, um, I filmed a video with Fleur a few months ago and she recommended this product and I still haven't got round to buying it. Um, but yeah, I've just spotted it and I've been recommended the hyaluronic acid, but they, they're sold out. But um, I'm gonna go to Oxford Street and apparently they might have it in House of Braze there. So I'm gonna go and have a look. Love a bit of Charlotte Tilbury. I haven't bought anything from here in a while, so I'm gonna have a little look. So I've realized I actually do need a new blusher. And um, looking at these, I thought I would go for like this one, but actually I just tried this ecstasy and it's so gorgeous, so I'm gonna get that. Oh, it looks so great. I'm loving all these decorations. How pretty is House of Fraser looking at the moment? I think this is the best 
kind of shop display that I've seen so far. So I've just arrived at Gleam but I'm going to jump straight in a taxi to a meeting that I have at Chilton Firehouse. Um, I actually totally forgot I had that this morning but um, yeah, good job I'm here to go right now on time. So I'm just back at Gleam now, going through my P.O. box. It's so funny when it comes to Christmas, just like so many of these gift sets are sent to me, but it's really cool. I'm just going through it. It feels like early Christmas. This is what I'm going through right now. A few bits and bobs. Look at how cool these socks are. They're amazing. I love these patterned stuff. Love a bit of a patterned sock. I don't actually know where they're from though. And then this t-shirt is so cool. This is by Marcus Lupfer and got some nice clothes here from Lacoste, nice bag here from Pelin, and nice skincare from Origins, Schwarzkopf, some canola here, and then yeah, a few bits and bobs at the back there. Wow, I feel like today has been pretty manic. I feel like I've just been running all over town. Um, yeah, I had my meeting that went really well at Chilton Firehouse. I couldn't really film much. In fact, I didn't film at all when I was there. Um, I just always feel like I can't really when it's meetings with a brand. Um, but then went back to Gleam and obviously went through my PO box. And um, I'm now back home, um, just quickly pulling some stuff together because I'm about to go and meet Joe. I found some really nice stuff during my shopping trip. It was really successful. Like, it was quite spontaneous, but... Yeah, it's always on those days when you find the most. There's really great stuff at the moment. Um, so, shall I give you a little mini haul before I head off? I'm about to go meet Joe, but um, yeah, let's do a bit of a haul. So here are my bags, things that I bought today. First of all, I'm going to show you this toothbrush by Oral-B because I am super, super excited. Oh, look, it's like a mirror. There I am. Um, yeah, so like I said earlier, I have actually had an Oral-B toothbrush for so, so long. They literally last for such a long time. Um, but this is the new Oral-B Genius 9000 and it's in a gorgeous purple colour. This is what I'm most excited about this. Look at how beautiful it is. Ah, oh, I've never had a purple toothbrush before. Fun fact guys, purple actually has a positive effect on your mind and body. So that's why I'm so excited to have a purple toothbrush right now. I'm actually in love with this colour. It's like a metallic purple. It's the prettiest toothbrush I've ever had. And I also, well, oh there we go. But I'd lost it then. I also got some toothpaste. This is the Oral-B gum and enamel repair toothpaste. They just work really well together. So I'm actually really looking forward to having like a new routine of brushing my teeth. But yeah, super excited about this purchase. Also the reason that I'm really excited about this purchase is because I got it today for better than half price. It's obviously Black Friday this week. Don't forget it. It's literally one of the most important days of the year, Black Friday. <laughs> you need to stock up guys. Um, but this Oral-B toothbrush is exclusively available at Boots at the moment and it will be better than half price. Um, but that will end at 11.59 on Friday this week, guys. So don't forget it. I feel like this will make such a nice Christmas present as well. For someone that's like into health and well-being and everything, especially because it's purple. So um, head down to Boots before 11.59 on Friday while you can get the discount. But I got some other really cool stuff as well. I walked past Zara and I was like, do you know what? I really don't need anything else. But I spotted a jumper right by the entrance. And I was like, okay, I need to go in. I just need to have a quick look. And I bought it. So let me just have a quick um, show and tell of what I bought. So this is the jumper I was talking about. It's in such a nice burgundy colour. And I love like that ribbed effect for the jumpers. It's such a nice material with high neck so i just thought that would look really nice tucked into jeans or a nice skirt with tights and i also got some jeans and these are really cool because they've got like a red stripe down the side and i don't have any trousers or jeans like this at all so they're quite daring but i'm gonna give them a go see if they fit and everything because i didn't have a chance to try them on and then, oh, you've actually already seen this in Charlotte Tilbury. I bought that blusher and this colour is called, if I can find it, this colour is called Ecstasy. And um, it's a really, oh no, oh no, I just put my finger in it. <gasps> That's the worst. Now I've got blusher in my finger. Oh, now I've got it on the jeans. Okay, this is what happens when you try and do stuff one-handed. Oh, yeah, and I also, I forgot about this. I did go to House of Fraser to um, find this, and I found it, the ordinary um, 
hyaluronic acid and then I also got the lactic acid which is a non-invasive exfoliator so I'm actually really intrigued to try these because I've heard so much about them. Another thing that I got that I'm so excited about, I've needed one of these, I say needed, I've wanted one of these for such a long time. This is the GoPro and I got the Hero 5. I'm basically um, going like skiing soon and actually in January but I just thought this would be so cool and every trip that I've been on this year I've just thought oh how great would it be to have a GoPro so I just feel like I'm going to be able to get some really great content especially with Vlogmas coming up I can just GoPro my whole life I'm like gonna stick a GoPro onto like my beanie hat <laughs> and just go around London and that'll be my Vlogmas like just unedited just a GoPro footage I've just wanted one for such a long time so I finally bit the bullet and went and bought one so I'm so happy with my purchases like I've covered all bases here I've got I've got my toothbrush I've got my camera and my equipment I've got some nice clothes I've got some makeup I've got some skincare perfect so like literally that I'm so so happy um now okay this is really exciting I am about to go and view a couple of flats with Jo. <laughs> We're moving in together and I'm like literally so excited. So um, yeah, I don't think I've told you guys this before. No, this is the first time I'm telling you. So yeah, we're moving in together in the new year and um, I've just had like literally the biggest smile on my face. Um, yeah, since we decided, but um, we are about to go and view a couple of flats and then I think we're gonna get some nice dinner. I haven't been out for dinner with Joe in a while just cause I've been away so much. We cook all the time together, obviously, um, but it'll be nice to just like head out and have a nice meal. So yeah, I actually need to get going. What time is it? It is 5.30. I need to leave in five minutes. I need to pack my bags and um, yeah, head off and meet him. Yay! <laughs> so we've come to a restaurant called Megan's. Look how pretty it is. I love all these flowers. It's like white roses in the ceiling. And over here, I've spotted a flapjack. Oh my god, I can zoom so close. I can literally see the flapjack from here. Dun dun dun. <laughs> Vegan chocolate. Vegan flapjack. Vegan oh no. Naomi. <laughs> How excited are you to live with me? Super excited. Are you worried about something that I might do that you'll hate? Um, <laughs> no. Nothing! No, I think we're right. I'm more worried about me. I think I'll be on, I'll be on like best behaviour, like eggshells everywhere. Uh, so. No, you can't be on eggshells. You need to be at home, comfortable, yeah, loving life. I won't kick you out. I'm trying to think. Unless you do something wrong. I haven't fallen out so far. So. No, we're good. We'll be good. <laughs> I'm absolutely exhausted. Today has been a long day. I feel like I've done a lot of steps. I've actually done 6,000 steps today. Walked 6,000 steps, which I'm pretty pleased with. Um, also, I realised just now that I have eaten out today for breakfast, lunch and dinner. That never normally happens. And I actually really don't like doing that. But um, yeah, it's a rare occasion. I much prefer like being at home and cooking my own food. Um, but dinner was actually so, so lovely at Megan's. And um, the flats actually weren't um, what we were after. That is a, that was a bad angle. Um, yeah, the flats we viewed today weren't exactly right, but um, I feel like we just need to view a few and then we'll find the right one. Um, but I am, I'm just now at Joe's and I'm looking through a book about um, like weekends away in Europe. And we're gonna go away in um, December to Bruges and we don't know much about it other than the Christmas market but um, we're gonna do a bit of research. Jo is just bringing over a cup of tea I think. So we're gonna like sit in bed drinking our cups of tea and researching about Bruges. This is the book. I actually bought this for Jo. Um, when was it? I think it was Christmas last year. And yeah, he said Bruges is in here, so I'm gonna find it. I found it. It looks so gorgeous here. Oh, I can't wait. Super, super excited to go here. Oh, hey. So I got my cup of tea and just gonna research Bruges and get an early night. I'm actually really feeling the effects of jet lag today. I'm um, felt really tired. <laughs> it's all right. 
It's all right. It's not super high production stuff. This it's all right. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm just gonna get some sleep because I have actually felt really tired today. Hopefully, I'll sleep better tonight than I did last night. But um, yeah, I really hope you've enjoyed watching this video. <laughs> You're fine. You can make a noise. <laughs> Joey's like tiptoeing around me. <laughs> um, but yeah, I hope you've enjoyed watching this video, guys. And I'll see you soon. <laughs> Bye.